So we are headed to Stonehenge. But if you tighten it too tight, you'll die in tight way. <laughs> Never thought we'd see this. This is pretty awesome. Hi guys, welcome back to the YouTube, YouTube family. family. So today is day three in London. And today we went to the Windsor Castle and we also went to the Roman Baths as well as Stonehenge. <laughs> as well as Stonehenge. So we're gonna go around and tell our favorite parts of the day. I'm gonna start first. My favorite part was probably the Roman Baths because it was really cool and they're it was just like a whole little city and it was really fun and you got to see like all the water from the natural hot springs that they actually like used back then. It was crazy. My favorite part was probably Bath and Stonehenge because Stonehenge is like so famous. It's just a bunch of rocks in the middle of nowhere and no one knows how it got there so pretty cool. Oh yeah, that was fun too. I agree. The Roman baths were the Boss. most. The Roman baths. The baths. Baths and bath were Boss. the. <laughs> they were the most interesting. They would be the one that would be most worth touring. I feel like um, because you kind of learned a lot about kind of life back then, but. Stonehenge was Stonehenge. <laughs> Stonehenge was actually my favorite because I remember seeing Stonehenge in like National Geographic magazines and things like that when I was little and I always thought what a mystery little. nobody knew what it's for and they still don't know why they were what they're used for and I just think that's such a cool mystery and then to actually see those pictures that you always saw as a kid I never thought I'd see those in my lifetime that was cool why, hello, Ty Ty. What was your favorite part? You guys like the baths. I like the rocks. What did you like? Stonehenge, the baths. I liked all of it. <laughs> you liked all, all of it. Okay. So I was like, I don't remember any of that. <laughs> I like I like the rocks because they're just random rocks there. Stonehenge. Yes. <laughs> that one, yeah, Stonehenge is pretty cool. No, literally, there's just rocks there for no particular. The reason why would someone just build it like that? <laughs> Nobody knows. Well, well there, there was, was actually reason. there was actually civilization around them because there actually was um, mounds that I think had like burial mounds and other things. So it, I think it was like I think they're right. I think it's used it as a calendar or a weather. But how did they get it keeping. there? Is the question. Yeah, the mystery is how did they get those rocks there? But it was very pretty. It was cool to see. Dad's turn. So I agree with everybody, but I also like Windsor Castle just for the fact that it was really cool. And one thing that happened is I got in the middle of the Queen's Guard as they were walking past, and they split up, and I was like standing in the yes. middle, and they marched past me. I thought that was really neat. <laughs> it's kind of in the way. Sorry about it, but uh, it's really cool. I got some good pictures from it. <laughs> yeah. All right, so those were our favorites of the day. So let's show you the vlog now. Let's go. We found a ladybug. So cute. We went to go into Windsor Castle. Yes. And it's a very, very, very long wait. wait so I we're entertaining ourselves. How old the ladybug is? How old the ladybug is? What's that for? That is the outdoor plumbing. Yeah, I didn't want to be near it back in the day. <laughs> Ty, you enjoying your tour? Ty had a wristband incident where it got too tight and he couldn't get the wristband off. Do you guys ever have that problem? The tour guide said, don't tighten it. If you tighten it too tight, you'll die. And Ty went. He went really tight. And then he was uncomfortable. Yeah. And we had to find a little shop to have it cut off. Let me get it on. Whew, he saved his arm. Yep, good thing. What'd you think of the king's room? Mm, big. Would you like the castle inside? That's like, that's mm. really one of the Yeah? Would you like to live there? Hmm. If I, if I was the king, no. So if, if I wasn't the king, yes. You don't want to be the king, huh? Because then I had to carry a big... The heavy robe? Yeah. What about you, Jake? Would you want to live there? Yes, yeah. only if I get all the items, too. Oh, would. Then yes. Alrighty. Do you girls want to live in that castle? 
That was really fancy. Yeah, it would be like too fancy for me. I'd be worried I'd break something. I'll live in it. <laughs> it looks cool. But Maybe for like a month. Yeah. It'd be fun to try. It'd be really cool, but I don't know. I feel like I'd break something or like. Wait. You gotta learn how to balance a book on your head. I would only. I would only live in there if Logan was in. Oh, that's Logan. True. We need to yeah. create a little dog. Well, actually, it wouldn't be a little dog room. All the rooms are huge in there. True. They're It'd be a giant big. dog room for Logan. True. Yeah. Decorated all nice and fancy. Oh, nice. There's been a lot of planes that have like, flown over this, and they're huge. Yeah, this is a flight path, but look at these castle grounds. Like, how cool to just have this and to wander around. Like, how do you keep track of your kids? Jordan, where are you from? Where are you enjoying this for your team to laugh? In Bath. <laughs> Can't say Bath, it's Bath. And how happy is Audrey? Audrey, I mean, she's pretty happy. She doesn't really she doesn't really want to eat the American food though in different countries because she wants to like experience the full on like culture and everything, but we just want to eat something to go. So fast, right? Yeah, we're just like, let's go Burger King and get it done. Exactly. But we'll as the English do later. Yes. But it's very hot in here. So I don't think they have AC. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Alright guys, we are at the Roman baths now. The bath. I should say. And this is what it looks like, you guys. It's so crazy. It looks kind of gross. <laughs> but we are here. Jake, are you so excited? This is cool. So the Roman bath is a natural hot spring and you can't drink out of it, out of the one that I just showed you. Showed you. But later on, we'll get an opportunity to drink some of the water that's been like purified and it's safe to drink and so I don't know <laughs> it'll still have the same color and it will be like the same so I don't know are you gonna be brave enough to drink it dad sorry not, not today not today what okay so this is the temple pediment and the different carvings represent the Celtics and the Romans culture coming together so that's the temple pediment very important Ooh. Yeah, very important stones. Um, it was actually a height of 15 meters. Cool! Here's the outer wall of the temple courtyard. And there's even some water down in there. <coughs> wow, this is So, this is what it looks like. I think we're gonna go down to the actual hot spring really soon. Okay guys, we're headed into the natural yes. hot spring. <laughs> yep, this has been really cool because there's a lot of artifacts here that are very interesting to see and kind of like just rare, you know, like you don't get to see these very often, so it's pretty neat. Yeah. Cool to learn about. Audrey, are you so excited? Yes, now I need to take a bath. You need to take a bath and bath? That's what this city is called, bath. Bath, bath, bath. not bath. Oh, I hear the water! Okay, so here is the spring, the steamy spring. You can see the water going down. And we're about to go. And we're about to go outside to the bath. Voila! Here it is, you guys. Oh, ta da! Whoa! This is cool. Let's see if I can show you up close. Oh man, you guys, this is so cool. It probably looks just like all green to you. But this is so cool. Mom being a little photographer, getting the boys' picture like a boss. Look at these stalactites, you guys. This is super cool. I think we're about to head back to the bus and head back 
to London. Yep, we need to go. It's 4.11 and we need to be there in 10 minutes. 10 minutes! Yep, so time to say goodbye to Bella. We're actually going to Stonehenge. Oh, yeah, we're not. Yeah, ready. the day okay. is not done. Oh, we're not done. We're going to Stonehenge, which is going to be fun. We have this. So let's go. We head to our back on the bus. What do you have to say about the baths? Well, I was going to get in, but uh, everybody told me I couldn't, so... Yeah, there might be amoebas or something. I guess it was like contaminated or something like that. I don't know, over a million years old. What do you think of Bath? Oh, it's pretty, I think it's pretty cool. It's, I think we could spend a lot of time down here and learn a lot of history. Do you want to move here? No. There's no air no. conditioning, right? Yeah. It's very hot. <laughs> and the water here is always like green. Because look at this water Natural fountain. Hot spring. Water. Water. No. That's just how bath works. <laughs> okay, so we are headed to Stonehenge. We actually can see it right now. It's surrounded by fields of grass. Lots and it's grass. pretty cool because I've only seen this on TV and in magazines and books. And so to actually be I here. Never thought I'd be here. Yeah, I never thought we'd see this. This is pretty awesome. Check it out. Jordan! We're here! Yeah! It's kind of interesting how it's just like a bunch of stones in the middle yes. of nowhere. There's like no trees by and it. Yes, it's just rocks, but how awesome. <laughs> they're ancient old rocks. But it's a mystery as to why they're there, so. 3,000 yeah. years old. 3,000 years old. 3,000. Pretty cool. Look at this though. Okay. Okay, this is so oh, beautiful out on, here. I would love to plant my I castle out here and live. <laughs> Not that I have a castle, but I would have a castle. Mom would build one I'm in Minecraft. <laughs> in my Minecraft castle right out there you in the field. You could build the seven wonders yeah. in Minecraft. And just add in an eighth one, which is the USA. Because oh. <laughs> we are a wonder. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, so Jordan, are you going to solve the mystery today as to why these stones are here? Yeah, I'm going to collect some samplings off of the rocks. Why do you of think? The moss. No one knows. And they do don't know. some research. But they think it's a calendar, and I kind of agree with the calendar theory. It could yeah. also be like a little. Uh, I think it was a. They had one time thought like a worshiping site or something. Hey, or an, yeah, a healing no. site. Yeah, I think it's a uh, calendar. Probably. <laughs> it seems practical for the area. Yeah, because there's like nothing else out here, so I yeah. don't know. That stone looks like a face. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that is really cool. You can take a couple. Yeah, it does okay. look like regular stone, but huh? like it's getting swallowed up by the other stone. Right. <laughs> like it's a square right, stone, like it's up. perfect wall. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. Thank you, sir, very much. That is weird. Are you trying to favor? I don't even know where I'm being sorry. All right. Huh. Awesome, I appreciate it. Thank you. Gotta turn out. Do you do a picture? Oh, yeah, now just do me and mom. Yeah, just me and mom. Take me on a tour, Ty. Where are we? We are in a hut. Are we in a hut at Stonehenge? Yes. This Did is people a bed. used to live this here? This is a bed. Oh. Wait, is it Stonehenge or Stonehenge? No, this is a bed. Hedge? Hinge. Hinge? I've been calling it Stonehenge. Hinge. <laughs> this is a bed. Oops. Ooh, I like oh, it looks bed. like a very comfortable bed. And that's a bed. Did you try laying on it? No. Ooh, I want to Give try. it a try. That's a bed. Ready, Ty? Let's okay. try it out and see. How's the new mattress? Don't break it. Let's, let's see, see if it's comfy there for you, girl. I think it's, it's so comfortable. It feels like I'm laying on sticks. Oh, he gives us a leg like this. And his head's on a rock. That's how you lay? It's not a rock, it's wood. Uh, oh, no. laying on the wood. It's very Actually, it's comfortable. comfortable. Nice. This is comfortable. Ty actually really thinks it is comfortable. I Would you like to live in here? Yeah. How many what? toys do you see? Zero. What would you play Ooh, with I in like here? This he could play with this. Do you play with candy? That's a shelf. So. That's a shelf, shelf for your pots and pans. This is a basket. Pans. And then that's a fireplace. Oh, and that's, that's a fire. stuff that you can sit on. Nice. Would you guys want to move in? Nope. I mean, if we had different furniture, I would. Oh, no. Because it looks yeah. really cool. It's actually really nice inside, but... But our um, whole family would have to sleep in here, so six of us. Mm, Look, maybe if there were like two of us? <laughs> Look, I'm out of this, bye. Oh, He's out, out of the challenge. 24 All hours right. in this hut. All right, goodbye, And James. now we're staying in. Close the what? Door. Okay, 24, 24 hours. hours has started. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, Jake wants to come back. Oh, you're coming back to join us? 
Now I want to show you something. Yay. Okay, show me. This way. What do you see? So I think this house is just a storage unit because it just has lots of stuff oh, in it. Oh, is yeah. there? You have your your regular house, then you buy the expansion pack, the garage. The expansion and then pack. you buy yeah, the garage has um, the garage you cannot open, it. but it's for decoration. It has a coat. So. It has a coat in it. It has a coat? Yeah, it has a coat oh, okay, and that works. a stove hey, and stuff. Hey, then you want to cold. Maybe it's a shed rather than the garage. There you go. <laughs> Okay, there'll be swallows or swifts. Oh. So the mother will come zooming in with food in a minute. Okay, I might back out so I don't get That's it dinged so in the cool. head. <laughs> there are baby oh, birds in there! Okay, well, I think it's probably time to get back up to our coach. Yes. Probably. Let's go. Cool. Okay, so we actually ended up, we're done with our tours and we ended at dinner time so we ended up at an Indian restaurant called the Indian Cuisine, Light of India and it, we're just waiting for our food. I hope it's good because we heard that a lot of people from here like to eat, eat Indian food. I don't know if that's true. If you guys are from England or London, let us know. Down below. <laughs> this should be really good. We're real safe. We got stuff. I mean, I don't like get chicken. I got lamb. Take a roll for chicken. Yeah, and we're gonna get garlic bread, and we're gonna get rice, which is lemon, and I love lemons. And by the way, did we tell you earlier that lemonade here does not exist? It's Sprite. And maybe if you're lucky, they'll put a little lemon inside, which is like the treat. And <laughs> now, everything here is sparkling, though. They're like, what kind of water? Sparkling or flat? Like, what? In America, it's just like regular water. They don't ask you if that you want sparkling water, which is very fancy. Otherwise, it's called soda or sparkling water. Yeah, sparkling soda. Particularly appreciated by the four Somebody got tired for dinner. He was up late, up early. He's tired. Jake's tired. The boys have fallen asleep at every single dinner meal. I think, I think they're still in jet lag. Their clock is way off. Like it's like, what is it? It's nine o'clock here, but back home it's only one o'clock. So they're like, it's two o'clock. They're, they're messed up right now. And the, the very first day, Mom woke up at like 3 a.m. Stayed up. So we got some video editing done. Yeah. Yeah, it worked. What you do? Okay, how was it? Uh, really, so good. It was really good, huh? I liked it. Thumbs up for me. So good. Yeah, I know we ate everything. We ate it all. I forgot to record. Good job, mom. Really good. But now we got un chocolat. 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 I can't. How do I know there's peanuts in it? I have to have dad, my guinea pig, try it first. <laughs> That's, true. That's the problem with being the peanut lady. I have to learn what peanut is in French. I, I looked up yesterday. What was it? I was practicing it last night at 4 a.m. trying to fall asleep. Because <laughs> I and I looked up how to order, but that was or like how to ask if it's in food, and that was way too much for me to handle because I had never learned any of those words. If I'm poisoned, it's his fault. It's very minty. Good. He's taking a moment. Hey. I think Tyler's asleep. Yeah. Oh, yes, sir, you're yours. Right. So we have a, a mile walk. Yeah. So we're going to get walking before it gets too dark. Because it's like 10 o'clock? Oh, it's dark. Never mind. <laughs> we're going to walk in the dark for a mile in an unknown town. Wish us luck. Wish us the luck. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog of us in London. Day 3. It was super fun. Such a blast. If you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe. Turn from red to gray. And hit the bell. And make today an adventure. We'll see you all next time. Bye. Bye.